you have probably seen devotees disagree on something, get into heated discussions, bring it home, talk about it, stew it up on the fire, spice it up, bring it, eat it for breakfast eat it for lunch, eat it for dinner, eat it for the next week, month. You've seen that. Maybe you've done that yourself. What I want to say is that in many cases, I believe this is due to offensive chanting, that you wouldn't be that obsessed. Because as you go more deeply in the holy name, you relish it. That's a sign. It becomes sweeter. And in that sweetness, the hearing of Bhagavatam becomes sweeter. The rendering of everything everything becomes sweeter and vice versa. Everything becomes less sweet as your chanting becomes less sweet. Your reading is less effective and less deep, less relishable. So it's just something to look for. Something, to, and I don't want you all going after this class, oh yeah, that devotee, that devotee. I always knew it, they were in my, you know, that's not the point. The point is to, you know, look at yourself. But sometimes if you're helping devotees and you see this obsession just ask them, Prabhu, how are your rounds? I'm probably going to say, not really good. Why do you ask? I said, yeah, then you can politely explain. I think you're a little too absorbed in this. And um, Trinata Visunichina, we want to be respectful.